Hello folks and welcome to another online adventure game. This is called Pizza Prince's Cake. That's what we're gonna be having. This is another game by Caramel Games. So let's play Pizza Prince's Cake. Hello Andreas. I wish to buy a piece of Prince's Torta. I am so sorry Sandro, but I can't sell it to you. Long time ago, my ancestors were at war with your ancestors. That is why every member of our family must take an oath not to sell princess cake to any member of your family. But that was 400 years ago. We have no idea what the fight was about. True, but still, although I am willing to break our family rule if you'll buy me a giant rock from the new Vikea furniture store. Fine. I'll see what I can do. Okay, so that's a storyline. He wants a piece of Prince's cake, but I guess this Viking here won't sell him a piece of Prince's cake because they're at war with one another. And the only way you can get a piece of Prince's cake is to buy a rock. Oh, the rock is in here. This rock right here. I always wanted one of those. It will look perfect in my living room. Perhaps I will buy it later, after I get me a piece of princess cake. Hello, I wish to buy a giant rock to place in my room. Oh really? I know why you're here, Sandro. You wish to buy furniture for my arch enemy, Andreas. No, it's for me. I want this giant rock to decorate my house. Spare me the lies. Andreas has been wanting to buy this giant rock for years but I wouldn't sell it to him. My ancestors were at war with Andreas' family for years. That's why he is banned from Vikea for life. Fine, whatever. Yep, so she won't sell it to us outright, so we gotta find a way to get it from her. That's my ex-girlfriend's helmet. I don't like her or her helmet. I should probably burn it. So that's a hint that you need to destroy this helmet. That's the rope I used to tie my boat. I'd better leave it here. And we'll pick up this cork right here. <coughs> oh, bird sounds. Hi, Mateo. What's up? Sandro! It's great to see you. Want something to drink? Oh wait, I'm all out of booze. Eric here drink all my beer. You look a bit tired. Yes, I had a bit too much to drink. Now I have a terrible taste of cheap beer in my mouth. So we need to find him something to get rid of the, the beer taste in his mouth. Let's pick up this arrow. And go back here. Pick up the bow. My bow. Too bad I'm a little short on arrows. But combine the bow with the arrow. And what do you know? It's an apple right here. A delicious apple. Too bad it's too high for me to reach. I'm scared to climb up this tree. Ooh, you're scared of it. We'll play William Tell and shoot the apple down. <laughs> Hello, how's business today? A bit slow. My boat is being repaired, so I'm here to bargain. Got anything interesting to offer me? I don't know. Well, I don't think he's interested in the apple. Will this interest you? Nope, I don't need something like that. How about a corkscrew? Will this interest you? Nope, I don't need something like that. Hello, what are you selling? Hello, my name is Henriette and I'm selling passion fruit juice. It's made of 100% natural passion fruit and it's said to turn bitter people into happy people. Cool, how much does it cost? A lot of gold coins. But I don't have a lot of gold coins. So you can't buy the potion? 
Oh, you have to buy that potion off of her. I see nothing special here. Actually, that's where the treasure is, but the game will not gonna let you get ahead of yourself. This is where we want, yep, I give the apple to him. Hey, Eric, I have an apple for you. It will help you get rid of the cheap beer taste in your mouth. Yes, thanks. It must be the beer talking, but I want you to have my trusty hammer. It's yours now. Take good care of it. Thanks. Oh, now we got a hammer. What can we possibly do with this hammer? Well, maybe we can destroy a biking helmet. I'll keep this horn. Yep, you'll keep the horn, yep. And we'll use it right here. Uh, ah! I'll pick up the feather. Use it here. Would you be interested in this feather? You could use it to replace the old feather in your quill. Yes, that's nice of you. I'll give you this expensive Ikea mug. Thanks. So now we got a beer mug, huh? So maybe we go over here. Use a corkscrew in a barrel. Wine. The barrel has wine in it. Oh, it's got wine in it. Now we can yep, take the mug and get some wine. Yeah, this game is pretty much a trade-off game. You trade one item for another. And maybe this guy's interested in wine. Will this interest you? Wine? I wouldn't pay for it, that's for sure. But I am willing to take it in exchange for this ripped map I found. Thanks. Now we got a treasure map. And we gotta put this together. The map says there's a hidden treasure right under the arrow sign. Yeah, I see under the arrow sign right here. I see nothing special here. Is there any chance you sell princess cake? No, sorry, but I can give you my shovel if that helps. Sure, why not? I didn't expect you to really take my shovel. I mean, I can't replace a slice of princess cake, but whatever. Here you go. Now we can go bury, dig up buried treasure. Yep. There's buried treasure in here. That should do. Just dug up treasure. I'm back, and I have lots of money. It's not enough, but I'll take it. Here's the potion. At Thanks. And I got the potion. And we're gonna go here, go over here. And give it to this bike. You must be thirsty. Want to try this passion fruit juice? It will make you feel better. Are you trying to bribe me? Well, I am thirsty, so I'll take it. It is good. 
I really do feel better. You know what? You may have this giant rock. It's yours for free. Thanks. Yeah, so... Ah, that's pretty much his game right here. As soon as we give him this rock, he'll give us the, a piece of Prince's cake, and the game will be over. So this is pretty much it right here. It's not that hard to get through. So if you want to get through it yourself, I'll put the link to this game in the show more section of this video. Here it is, a genuine Vikia giant rock. Great! Now I'll bring you a piece of my delicious princess cake. Hooray! Oh, hooray, yep. That was a piece of cake. <laughs> yep, and so is this game a piece of cake, pretty much. <laughs> yep, this is Gamer Lawn signing out, saying thanks for watching, and I will talk to you later, folks. Take care.